Good morning, boys and girls. Look at what I have. A story tied to the three little pigs. Now, this is one of my favorite stories because it's about three little pigs who, when they got big, left their mommy's home and went out to build their own homes. But two of the little pigs were very lazy and didn't want to put the hard work into building their homes. So one of those two little pigs built his house out of straws and the other one out of sticks. But then the third little pig was a smart little pig, built his house out of bricks. Now after building their homes, there was this big bad wolf. Yes, a big bad wolf who came and he wanted to eat the little pigs. So he went to the first house and said, little pig, little pig, let me in. And the little pig was like, no, no, not bad here of my chinny chin chin. The wolf said, then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. And he did, he huffed and he puffed and he blew the first little pig house down. The same thing happened with the second little pig. Now when he went to the third little pig, no matter how he huffed and puffed and huffed and puffed, he couldn't blow the house down. So he had to go away sad. And just as this little, third little pig was bright, a bright little pig, we have to be like that. Whenever we are doing something, we have to try our best and make sure we give it our best. Can you figure out the number of the day? Yes, boys and girls, it is the number three. Show me three fingers. Let's count to three. One, two, three. Good job, boys and girls. Now I have some stuff to count. In my counting box, I have counting blocks. So I have one counting block, blocks, two counting blocks, three counting blocks. Three counting blocks in my counting box. When I rolled the dice this morning, oh my, yes, I got the number three, three dots. I have here three little triangles and they are all blue. One triangle, two triangle, three triangle. <clears throat> Look at our national flag. It has three colors and the three colors are red, white, and black. And remember, red is for fire, White is for water and black is for earth. I have three cotton balls, one cotton ball, two cotton balls, three cotton balls. And look at this. I have one book, two books, three books. And oh my, I have some CDs this morning. One CD, two CDs, three CDs. And I have a playing card with three diamonds on it. Three big diamonds and the number three. One, two, three big diamonds. Now this is the number three. You go around and around. And on my card I have three balls. One, two, three. Good. Now I wanted to practice writing the number three in the air. So put your pointer finger halfway around, halfway around. That's the number three. One more time. Halfway around, halfway around, that's the number three. So I'll show you how to write the number three on the board. On my board I have halfway around, halfway around. And we're gonna count the apples on the board. One apple, two apples, three apples. Good job boys and girls. Now that we know how to write the number three, and how to count to number three, we're going to spell the word name three. So let's go, we're gonna clap spelling three first, slowly so that you can get it. T-H-R-E-E-3. -E High five in the air. T-H-R-E-E-3, -E up at the roof. T-H-R-E-E-3, -E -E down at the floor. T -H -R -E -E E, E, three. Wave at me. T, H, R, E, E, three. Should be three fingers one more time. Three. Let's spell three. T, H, R, E, E, three. Now that you can spell the word name three, write the numeral three, and count three things, you are going to write three in your drawing box, draw three things for me, and write the word name three. 
Remember, three is halfway around, halfway around. Count to three. One, two, three. Word name three. T-H-R-E-E-3.